You guys probably don't find it interesting, but I find it fascinating where we park every single time. So this time we were right underneath the uh, pretty much monorail for Magic Kingdom because see, there is the entrance right there. Just so you guys realize what the lines will be like if you come by and your tickets stay up. She's chanting Disney. First photo opportunity of the day, the road station, which is almost identical to the one in uh, Disneyland, but not completely. Yay. Maria and Pluto are out. And interesting spectacle. The castle is taller than it normally is. Why? Because they're working on the top. How sad and unique. And completely breaking the magic. I'm surprised, Disney. I'm surprised. All right, you. Come on. We're gonna go get our carts. It's not time to eat. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's someone actually working in that thing right now. And the castle show is about to get over, so I'm curious if they're about to shoot the fireworks off. No, no fireworks. We're going to be safe for the guy up there. Hey. I was worried about that. So we just switched Elaine to be in the key holder because she's the one playing the game. So no matter what, she activates portals now. So there's no worry about me having to be here with my magic band. And we got our three decks for today. Scanned our magic band, handed out our spells. So, oh, they double sided. So you can't tell who's in there. Oh, tricky. Tricky and smart. And our, our big deck. You got her! I opened a deck that was going to be mine, but she claimed it as her own because there's Snow White in there, right? Yeah, it's yeah. going to be mine. Yeah, it's going to be yours. Can you see who else is in there? Who else do you got? Snow White. Yeah. Oh, you got Bowler Hat. Yeah. Oh, and there's Blue. Pumba. Mad Hatter. Which I think we already have, so I think that's a double. No. Yeah, Pumba. And Mad Hatter. Okay. Right, can I see him? I'll put him with the rest. I'm so happy I got Snow White. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you heard the song when you came here with Mommy? Because they do this song a lot. Yeah. Let me just say, probably the best view in the entire kingdom. That guy working up there. It's open today. So the Diamond Horseshoe is a seasonal. Or they're trying out a new menu or something. So we've never eaten there. Oh, it looks like a buffet. Yeah. Interesting. Well, it's a quick service, I think. You want to go in real quick? Yeah. Good look. Well, I'm going to... So this is menu time. So here's the horseshoe. All right, so you order when you first enter. Pick up. So go through there, go right. Keep going straight when it gets to the opening. Go left. Interesting. So the menu and prices. So it was much, much more fun when it was the, the villain's dance party at the Mickey's Not So Scary. But yeah, so you order and they just have a little like quick service bar you come pick up and sit. Daddy. Use your fast pan. No, not yet. Okay. All right, go back. Do you want your hat? I'm Odie. You have it backwards. You have to show them Snow White. We need a crystal. What you got? Ooh, some bad boy been messing around and brought this shadow man back. Tough career choice, I know. Keep your gig as jester in the river of souls here, or go back and be king of the Mardi Gras. But just one condition on that king offer, you gotta bring me the crystal of the magic king. Double for today, Pumba. Toad is new. New over there. Cinderella, double. The giant. Pete. New. And Aurora. And Sarah got Those two doubles. Two doubles. Frozen and Dash. Yeah. She got Maurice. Queen of Hearts. And Tiana. Oh. Think we should use Tiana? Princess Day. Forever. Forever. 
Princesses. princesses. Yay. All right, to the next spot where our princesses can defend the kingdom. We're right there. So Frontierland is Tiana and Pocahontas, which sort of makes sense. So then you have Aurora and Ariel and Fantasy Land. And Li okay, and Liberty Square. And then what well, you said, the main street was it's Corella. And then I don't know who the other one that might yeah. be, it might be Cruella and Hades. No, I think Hades is anywhere. I wonder if it's like Snow White or something, because I'm sure they have all the princesses. We're su we're surprised that there's no Cinderella. Oh yeah, I don't know. I don't know, we'll have to see. Yeah, we'll have to, we'll have to do them all. From the back of your spell car. Pulling, <laughs> now's your chance. Quickly, no. over. Good job. Her dress is blue. Her dress wasn't green. What was up with that? Where are we going next? So, I know I'm supposed to be doing Aurora still, but it's Mickey. I'm gonna do Mickey. Interesting. That was fascinating. I wonder if all the doors lead somewhere. That smells so good. What is it? I, I don't know, but it smells good. It might be hot dogs. No, it doesn't really smell like hot dogs to me. He's ready. Oh, and the curtain's open and everything. This is the most impressive one so far. He's on the side. Yeah. I don't know why the other one. Cast your spell. Oh, that was Snow White. Oh, no, that's, that's me. Snow, please, give a poor fellow a break. Go, Mickey. What about Eve? And Eve. I like Eve. Where are we going next? Adventureland. So this looks like there's a person in front of the sign, but where Tiana was inside the Heritage House looks like now to be a fast pass kiosk. So there's now a fast pass kiosk over here with Tiana. So that's nice. That's new. Wasn't there beforehand. You activating it? All right, come back. Yzma is in Adventureland. So we're using Crest to stop Crone. This could be a whole new direction. Yeah. So where is it sending us next? Let's see if we can see. Alrighty. Here's where you're going next. Moha Isle Refreshments. Use We can confirm there are three different ones in Adventureland. Scar, Genie, and Yzma. Or Stanley Scar, Jafar, and Yzma. So, we can, well, that's what I said. We can confirm that those three are here. I'm very curious on how many there are and where everyone is. I want Snow White to go. So, we'll, we'll do my best to help Elaine get Snow White. Stand up. All right, ready? Hold it out. Oh, so that was Snow White. Oh, I think you can both. Yeah, we must have done both. We're gonna get Doris as the goal. And then the giant. Where we get? Oh, it's Doris. Mr. Toad. So along with Source of the Magic Kingdom, they have a pirate adventure over here. So Tortuga Tavern, Pirates of the Caribbean, and Splash Mountain is right there. So if you're trying to locate it, it's this little spot right there. And it's, they claim it's what, like a 40 minute adventure to do all the pirates. So it's, if you it takes about the same amount of time as the one at Epcot. Yeah. 
Just it's in a smaller space. Yeah, Epcot, you're walking around a lot going to different countries. This one, it's just contained in Adventureland, but interact with a whole bunch of things and trying to find, I think, Jack Sparrow's treasure, I think is the story. So, a lot of interaction. We've been hearing Bell and Cannon go off the entire time we had our, Elaine had her small little lunch, so. That's where it is if you're interested. More things to do that you probably wouldn't think to do on your normal day. In case we weren't Disney enough, that we couldn't you know, show our Disney facts enough, Elaine has decided that the stroller is 100% positively Disney because the guy at the Disney Vacation Club gave her an entire string of stickers. And they're going on the stroller. So I know a lot of things around here interact. I'm kind of curious if the front door does anything. A little sad that it doesn't if it doesn't. Like, I'd like the knocker to move or something. But it's not doing anything. Elaine, can you say that again? I'll show you home. She's ready to host the ride. She's ready to say a ghost will follow you home. <laughs> Elaine asked why it's so stuffy in here. And I told her because it's full of dead air. us already this one too it's as if they're gonna come alive oh see the weather it's nice and clear outside they're still watching us I can watch you back ah too much
We stopped by the Sunshine Tree Terrace to get some Are vanilla ice cream because that's what this was wanted. Stop before we go on the next ride. And all we've been smelling is the food from Skipper Canteen, and, and my it so yes, good. it does. <laughs> it smells amazing. Like I want it. I want it. I got this one now. Say hi. This is how busy today is. This? That's a line at Tom Sawyer Island. I've never seen a line to Tom Sawyer Island. I've never seen a line. So this is the first. They got a sign out. Apparently there's, they already have like a snake queue for the Fast Pass. They have a line out for the Fast Pass. So the Fast Pass is a normal line. The Splash Mountain is down, but we're going to do the train. See all the stops, because we've never done it before. We like doing new things. And taking you guys along with us. Because that's fun, isn't it? You guys like it, right? No. It's Woody and Jesse. Just looking at my camera. Can't say her. Andy's coming, her bunny's coming. Andy's off the couch. Doing our best to beat the parade before it starts. Can we do it? Because music has started. I think you'd still get across it if you can. Here, should, we, should we send a picture to Grandpa? Yeah. Someone can make a comment on the fast bus line being really long. Someone didn't greet George properly. What? Someone didn't say hi to George properly. Oh, it's not working? Nope, it is closed due to technical difficulties. So if you have a fast pass... You should be open to something else. Should have got a notification. I haven't yet. I mean, it just happened, so... Just like that, the ride's back open. You know what I think happened? Huh? I acknowledge George. It's all George thanks to me. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. And now the slow moving upward escalator. <laughs> Did you enjoy that? You look like you're unsure what you just watched. Ridiculous. 80 minute wait for Dumbo. And the fast pass line. What is going on with Disney today? This is worse than summer. Sarah claims there's a hidden Mickey, which you sort of see right there. Sarah claims there's a hidden Mickey over there. You can sort of see at the bottom right hand of the peanut. I got left behind. I have no idea what's going on here. Like this, this is the fast pass line. I've never seen it this long. Like it is, and it's not just like it's loose. It is literally backed up all the way over here for the sheer amount of fast passes. Like this is unfathomable. Like I'm beyond speechless. So the app shows it's open. You can get fast passes for it, but. This place today is is not a good Disney day. So with Disney deciding to flood the Fast Pass system with an extreme amount of Fast Passes, the park being busy on its own. Oh, she dropped the cap to the water. We decided there's absolutely no reason to stay in at Magic Kingdom. Like any Fast Pass we get, we're waiting an excessive amount of time as is. So 
we're off to explore some of the resorts and uh, who knows what happens after. This Disney failed today with this experiment. I know that they've been trying a lot of experiments lately. This one was a major fail. And I feel really bad for the, all the people who I saw that were their first visit, because this is not the Disney experience you should have. So we're at Port Orleans French Quarter. Just, just listen to that. You guys hear that? Nothing. A few distant cars. So much different than Magic Kingdom. Maybe, maybe this won't be too bad. We're gonna go eat. Sarah's getting her beignets because she's wanting her beignets. And here, we'll show you guys the hotel, the resort. Is this a vacation club resort? Uh, no, not this part of it. Okay, so you guys can come here. Yeah, I did it. We've lost our jacket. We've lost our shoe. Actually, the last time we came here, we used the umbrella because it was raining. Yeah. Arr, yeah. Well, you're happy. Of course. I mean, I guess it's a Mardi Gras place. Why not go over the top? So, uh, Lane got a pizza. It's cooking. A uh, giant chicken platter. Cookie. They're making Sarah's beignets. There's the page for the pizza. Yeah, do you see the giant face? Yeah. And this one keeps throwing every everything in off her shoulder. Throws everything out. Well, getting a soft drink on Disney property, at least at a hotel, is probably one of the smarter ways to get more drink for your buck. In order to prevent you from just buying one and using it the entire time you are here, Disney has these little chips on the bottom that you have. It pretty much has to scan on the pop machine, or the soda machine, before it distributes the drinks. Doesn't have it on the tee? No. Well, it allows you to have like four or five refills in like a 24-hour period. So that prevents you. You still get you know four or five refills, but it's not unlimited. Well, but you can't buy the unlimited. Yes. And it lasts for a certain amount of days, and as long as you use like that to token, like that's on your cup, I think eventually, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, every single one has it. You guys can see it. Right. We're showing you guys the beignets before they were touched. How much powdered sugar do I have on my face? <laughs> Not that much. Yes, that's half eaten. Great, thank you. So how was it? It was good. A sneaky sneak. <laughs> We went to the bathroom. Sneaky snook. One of the advantages of Disney is that every single hotel resort is different and all with their own theme. So, no, we're gonna go this way. We're gonna look at the store. So, I mean, if you do get tired of the parks, you need like a break. Tired of the, the parks or you need a break, come, come to one of the, the resorts. They are different, they all have unique stuff. They're, they're fun. Like Mardi Gras stuff. That's the animated collection we have. Yeah, look, the little dolls from the animators collection. I didn't know they made stuff like this. Look at Bunzel. I'm going to show her this too. Oh, and look at that. That's nice. Can you look at. Where's Snow White? There she is. I call in the so this one to mommy too. Yeah. There's the Shelly May book. There's Duffy. Come on, Elaine. So what are these? Oh, nine pin collection. So these are mystery pin boxes. The Princess Cameo Mystery Collection. No, oh, so these are the ones you can get. Okay. So let's see what you can get out. Oh, they're like cards. In this gym short. This one's good. I like Peter Pan. Look, you see Peter Pan and the Peter Pan ride? Yeah. That's a good one. I like that one. Me too. I like it too. And of course, she likes the Seven Dwarfs. Hey. Nice Valentine's Day one. Hey! Yeah. Yeah, look at them. Don't touch, please. Don't touch. Uh, Lady Tinkerbell. I like the Kermit. Hey. Yeah, it's a Cheshire cat. I'm going to show mommy that. Oh, and there's a villain cup. 
Coralines. Hang on. Character construction. Those are interesting. I need to go party. And it's fallen, so it can't really show you as much of uh, the French Quarter as you can. I've never been to New Orleans, but I, honestly, this is kind of what I expect it to look like. A bunch of trees overhanging, semi-old-fashioned lights, not the alligators playing music instruments in the middle of the street, but everything else. So they got a little kids play area on one side. The other side, it looks like clothes, maybe a hot tub. Down the center, you have the pool. See giant clam and water. They got a little bar to the side. And it looks like part of it's under construction, which is just sad because it looks like a kid's area too. So the round pool. There's looks like, a, like a dragon water slide. Yeah, the kid's section is entirely under construction. So they got a bridge over. Yeah, so that looks like a small little water slide. Up a dragon, because apparently a dragon is a theme. And there's the dragon's tail sticking out. Here's the end of the, the dragon's tail, or sea monster. So it goes over there, to there, to the bridge, to the slide. I do like the look here. Huh? I like the, the steel, like the, the wrought iron. It, it definitely sets itself apart. Because it looks like a hotel at the same time as it doesn't look like a hotel. So I like it. And a small little blue section. Weird. There's a serpent's face and a semi king triton on top. The adventure of Disney continues as we wait for the boat to go to Disney Springs. So we've gone from maybe exploring resorts to Disney Springs. You never know where we're going to end up. Because Magic Kingdom failed us today. <laughs> I will hold to that. that oh, there goes the this trip was ruined because of Disney Wait, Springs. No. Incoming boat. So it doesn't want to focus because the lights keep changing, but there are lights in the trees. Look at the tree, look at the tree. Look at it go. It's dancing. Remember this door? Celine climbs into a tree. Come on, Elaine, let's go inside. Let's see if we can design a shirt. No, don't. We're just looking. This isn't a game. This is design a shirt. What color? You say pink? What character do you want to? Well, let's look at the princesses. All right, hit the green button. Let's 
empty. You think there's a Snow White one? There's, there's. I'm gonna see this one. Well, here, let's see what other ones there are. Look. Look at all of them. I bet you there's Snow White. <laughs> all right, hit the next step. Green button. Oh, then you can build your own text. So let's go back and see. Let's do a different color. Oh, silver pink. Do the resort logos. The one for contemporary. Oh, that's I pretty that nice. Done. Hang on. Go. For, for this family. One. I want a snow white one. Yeah, but look, it's a contemporary one. One by one, the snow white one. Do you want to sit in this roller? No. She wants to climb. No, I don't want to see snow white. So now that you guys kind of see what you can do, let's look at the celebration. Hang on, hang on, we're looking. Looking at everything. Birthday. So you guys go, you can design your own shirt. They have a bunch of different designs. Apparently different kids and adults. So let's look at the princesses again. That's the same. Oh, let's go this one. It is pink. It's a different pink. Just so you guys can get it. So that's that sort of stuff. You can add your own text. Pump oh, pirates. Kind of cool. So I was just informed that when we have a formal dining room, we must decorate it with the haunted mansion paintings. Okay. Oh, there's Mary Poppins, Mickey Minnie. Next door we go. Who doesn't love Christmas? All right. No. It's Oogie Boogie. Look, Elaine. Oogie. Yeah, it's Sally. I'll try all the number for Christmas stuff in the Christmas store. Oh, that's pretty good. I like that. I'd say 35. Down? 25? 15? 20. 19.99. Oh, Christ. Less look. Than I thought. Look, Elaine, look. It's baby zero. It's puppy zero. Oh. And they got the movie going. That's brilliant. <laughs> Some of these classic Mickey and Minnie. Oh, look at the Dumbo. Dumbo. Elaine, look. Or Evelyn, look. <laughs> Who is he? Hey, no, we're not going to design our own Mr. Potato. Sarah, Sarah has a very strong nostalgia for Mr. Toad. I did not grow up watching Mr. Toad, so I have no nostalgia for him. Mansion, Cheshire Cat, and Mr. Toad. Which you see the Cheshire Cat bird feeder or birdhouse? Yeah. It's Sarah's chick mug. She's been asking it for a while. She's on her last leg. She's holding on for dear life. They don't have her Cheshire Cat car topper anymore. Door that knows you're going to get strollers. It's very hard to move something on that carpet in there. Like, impossible. 
Lego store. Still a lot of work being done Disney Springs. A lot of new stores is going to be opening up soon. How is that? It's 50 bucks, but come on. So we are home. We're going to start working on yesterday's video because I have had no time because I got up when we left. So, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Every time you're watching this, thank you for watching. We will see you all again tomorrow. My hand looks really, really big right now.